X is not a small country uh, is an attempt to look at uh, our current post-global uh, condition, one in which the ideas about globalization and its sort of inexorable progress, let's say, have been completely subverted and collapsed. It's looking at the ways in which uh, the world is deglobalizing uh, and reglobalizing at the same time, the different sort of realignments and reorderings that, that are happening, often following uh, different sorts of uh, agendas and, and logics in overlapping and sometimes contradictory ways. It really uh, is an attempt to look at the increasingly convoluted and complex uh, state of the global that, that we're seeing. understand a bit more what this post-globalist idea means. We're talking about infrastructures, we're talking about supply chains, we're talking about places of extraction, but also places where the resources that are extracted are manipulated, transformed and applied. We're talking about the territories that even if they are really far apart, are indeed connected. We're talking about economies and also about e-commerce platforms. So the participants indeed, in different ways, through different means, through different tools, they bring it here into a research, case studies, which are indeed extremely tangible. When we began thinking about the show, it was uh, very clear to us that uh, things were unfolding uh, in, in, in real time, sort of right before our eyes. I mean, we're talking about everything from trade wars to rising nationalism and populism to refugee crises and, and Brexit. And then, of course, the pandemic hit. And that really sort of emphasized this very confounding state of the global that we're now seeing. It's really like a puzzle, an open puzzle. We could have more participants to enlarge the geography and to enlarge the collection of systems which are observed. So let's say that the concept of uh, what was interrupted, what survived uh, in terms of flow of energy, resources, money, the new company, government, collaborations, uh, for the definition of new cities or new implementation of different systems of control, in a way. This like, are all aspects that uh, appear. And so the beauty of the exhibition, I think, is that like many narratives can be created depending on how you travel through the landscape itself. Do you look at resources? Do you look at materials? Do you look at territories? Do you look at um, uh, the characters, the people? That's uh, the final reading could bring, which is indeed also open and in question. There are a lot of changes underway in the world. Uh, things, are, things that we once really took for granted uh, can no longer be taken for granted. Different ways of seeing, of understanding, of comprehending, of even constructing in our minds what the world is through these narratives that we uh, have been following uh, in recent decades. Those, are, those have all broken down. And this is happening right now before our eyes in real time. And so we hope the show gives a place where people can think about this, where we can talk about it, and begin to understand what is happening and how we can respond. Mm -hmm.